All right, howdy, howdy, everybody, once again. This is, uh, I'm going to bring you a little more news today and see how things go. Um, let's see here. So a little bit, what I've picked up so far is it uh, looks like John Durham is also going after uh, some of the, the, uh, some of the presidential advisors, some of the Clinton people, or and he had ties with the Clinton people. Anyhow, um, he, uh, I'll find where I can get some light here. There we go. He, yeah, he, so John Durham's going after him. Uh, his name is, uh, you got to my notes here. His name is Jake Sullivan. That's who, uh, John Durham is going after or, you know, investigating right now. So, uh, you know, he's actually the guy that, uh, made false statements and created a false narrative to allow for the, all the, uh, illegal warrants and uh, other things to come out to try to uh, accuse Trump of the Russia, Russia, Russia. All right. So uh, let's see how that goes. Of course, not going after Hillary herself. But a lot of times, you know, what people got to understand is you have to uh, do things in a step. You want to, if you don't cover your case, then your investigation can become botched and it become we can get holes in it and it makes it easy to, for people to get out of. So if you can really like, you know, you've got to work, you start from the roots to take the whole tree. It's kind of how it rolls. But if you just cut the tree off, a lot of times you get those little things that grow back up and you don't see the stump and you hit it with your riding lawn mower and you bend the deck and or, or you know, then now you've got a, a whole nother mess on your hands, you know. So the best thing to do is start from the roots up. It's kind of how that rolls out. So uh, another thing uh, that's really cool, or not cool, but what we have noticed is Kamala Harris left for a secret trip to California. It was not documented. Um, it was kind of leaked out by some of the administration. And uh, it's by the way, it's not the place that she lives at at all. Evie wants to be on camera. She's a good girl. She's my dog. And so she's... We're not sure what's going on with that. That's kind of weird. And um, we'll keep an eye on that. You know, Kamala's always up to something, though. You, you think about that. She's just always up to something. For a while there, every time she'd get on the plane, she'd have a, you know, a red carpet and a four-horse carriage and 35 people videoing it. Every, you know, it was all over Instagram. And um, now, now we just ain't, we ain't, you know. You know, she got hit with that uh, direct energy weapon. Or so to be told, she had she caught that uh, Havana syndrome. More than likely, her they're trying to like replace her brain or something. And it takes you know you have to go in there and work on it a little bit and then let it you know let it run it a little bit and see how it goes. I don't know. We won't go too deep into that, but something did happen ever since that time where she was down in uh, Guadalajara, somewhere down that way. It's when she got that Havana syndrome. Anyhow. So, Kamala Harris always up to something. Uh, Biden's numerous trips. I want to say 17 plus trips. Every weekend we go to Delaware. We don't, And it's not at all, uh, No, he won't disclose what's going on there. Now that's kind of like coming about. That's got uh, Jeff uh, John Durham's uh, attention. That's kind of what's going on with that too. Uh, we don't know. You know, he's going there every weekend. And he claims he's going to see grandchildren, but if that was the case, it wouldn't be so secretive. So we'll see what happens. That's, he hasn't worked a weekend that I know of. The whole time he's been like doing presidenting, supposedly, he has not worked at one weekend. And there's also reports that he's handled very closely in the White House so that he's not wandering about and doing certain things because of his cognitive disorder. Or de I'm sorry, cognitive decline. Uh, just weird how they, how nobody's forcing them to actually take that test that they made that made Trump do. That was, that's just weird. They made him do all that. You know, he passed it with flying colors. He didn't even fight. He said, "I'll do it." And you can't get Biden to even think about that. A lot of people think too that, that well, or a lot of that out spec speculation could be that he's dealing uh, with Hunter down there over there in Delaware and it has to do with the illegal trades with China. We'll see how that goes. We don't, something will come like truth always comes out. So uh, let's see here. Uh, do, 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 the, the investigations that had to do with uh, 
with the Clintons that had that you know that made all the false warrants and everything that what they there was a lot of collusion between FBI and hackers so Durham's going to be on top of that and then let's see uh do 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 do, do. one one question would okay now that a lot of things everybody's talking about now including me you know whose job is it to issue the subpoenas for the uh fax machines that were uh, used to do the really awful t uh, checking of the people. You know, is it uh, Karen Fan or is it old Mark Burnovich? You know, I, on the other hand, think we've already had a subpoena on the, what was it, July 26th or something right around there when that's the first subpoena was issued and it was so not even worried about it. They were like, could you imagine... Me sitting here at the house and somebody has a, a subpoena and or warrant and I'm in my, I'm in my, here, you know, you know I'm just not going to go and they, you know, they're just going to roll up and let, like, they're not going to police knock the door down and come in there and get me. Nope. They're going to come get me. They're going, you're going, you're going to be here. You are subpoenaed to be here. You have a warrant for this. So you are, I mean, really, and it could be over something as simple as riding your go-kart on the highway. But these people here, they, they can just no questions asked just uh do whatever say you know well we don't feel like we need to honor that subpoena and and, and you know and, and overrode a judge's order and the judge is okay with it. it's like well whatever and so they're going to issue more subpoenas uh you know i'm not going to discourage anybody all i want to do is want people to be aware of what's going on you know Politicians play politics, so that means that they they hear the people holler and they're going to do it because they want to be reelected. So that means, like I keep saying, you've got to make all the noise you can. You've got to get in the middle of the street and jump up and down if you have to. You know, stop the car. We well, don't stop the cars, but metaphorically speaking, yeah, that's what we need to do. So, um, yeah. We're going to make this happen. We are going to win. We are the majority. I really thank all you people for tuning in. Help me come up with a good name for this channel so we can get this algorithm to start rolling. Because I want to get some more of these videos out and do some really fun stuff. i got a lot of ideas in mind. So uh, let's see if we can get this thing to blow up. Please like and subscribe and share. And, uh, and you know, help me out. It would really be great because I just all I want to do is just try to help people and help America. I want these kids to grow up and have a, a good future or the best that they can. So thank you again once again for tuning in. Y'all have a good evening. Bye.